Hello there guys and welcome to another video discussion. The subject today is about Blizzard Store and their idea of adding level 90s characters and sell them out to people. So basically I'll explain my thoughts about this and in not so many details because I don't know yet if X person can purchase the way he wants that level 90 character, you know design, gear class, spec etc or a character made by someone who was playing and wants to sell it out easily via Blizzard Store in Warlords of Draenor. So let's see the advantage and the disadvantage, I'll start with the advantages and then with the opposite effect of the ideas. In case the characters that will be sold out are from players, it will be an easy way for them to offer to someone else that is curious about the game and play it. Also get profit from this instead of just watch that account being covered by web spiders I guess. Alright, it's their game and I know that me or someone else that expresses his opinion about this will not be taken serious by Blizzard. They do what they want with the game and we have just two options, accept it or don't care, in case you still play the game of course. We have to think like this after all, that piece of paper with numbers on it, which we call it money, can be used by people as they want, and throw it how they want. Blizzard said that they learn from mistakes. When I heard that I was like, yeah, sure, we'll see about that. So through this process of selling level 90 characters, it's obvious they are after profit since the game after so many years is going down and down, people get bored. So to easily give a hand to curious ones to join the game and keep the subscription stable, they offer this option. So the issue is, if people that will accept and take a level 90 character will lose the total idea of the game. Leveling up, lore, learning and understanding the skills better, when you receive them, mounts, all the zones, professions. Like imagine someone logging on his damn purchased level 90 character, for example a paladin, watching on left side and on right side. He is looking at avenging wrath spell, boom, wings, Megus, I can fly now? Well I can fly now, damn it! Something like this. Alright, maybe I took a noobish way to put it, but you guys get the idea even though the game is made now that even casual players handle easily their classes or much easier ways to get to a dungeon. Day by day people want to have easy way to do something and receive many things from it. No more grinding, you don't have to run since Wrath of the Lich into all dungeons and raids with your guildies, thanks to looking for raid and dungeon finder in BGQ. Entering the game, press H, dungeon, blah 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 and fap. Each expansion became much more easy, because people don't have time anymore, they have a job or different things to do, not just games, games, games. The main thing is that we will suffer the most through this process, we have to handle all the upcoming changes that turns this game into some sort of pay to win process. Makes me puke that new people won't give a fuck about what we enjoy the most and see them only running around and cause a negative atmosphere in the community. I'll give an example, something like, oh man, finally after 2 months of grinding for legendary cloak and now here it is. And someone right behind you is like, oh yeah, this is the legendary cloak for only 50 bucks, thank god I purchased this character, I won't need to grind like a faggot after it, <laughs> something like this. Indeed, new people will be motivated to come and current players will have a reason to leave the goddamn game. I'll feel like this will not be the same game I was playing and it's something completely fishy about it. Blizzard will get profit, boohoo, they won't care until they will realize that the community will be fucked and also subscription will be down. All players won't have a reason to play it anymore and from PvP perspective, arena competition, etc. will become a kindergarten playground. We have to deal with many new outcomers to the game and we'll not have the time to stick around them and make them understand the game easier so they will drastically become disappointed and will realize it was a waste of money. Or I don't know, maybe a few of them will be like, fuck yeah, worth it because I said so. So the result will be the same, subscription will go down. But to avoid making this video hate towards such upcoming changes by purchasing level 90s, I'll say this, it's your money not mine, you choose on what or not waste it, Blizzard's decision not ours how to make the game much better and get profit out of it. In case they keep this idea of purchasing characters, mounts, pets or I don't know maybe also professions, they need to remove the payment subscription from it to be efficient and not somehow cause damage to community and lose more players. Let me know your thoughts people and yeah this is what I had to say. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Cheers!